Hello uh, everyone, this is the recording of uh, the sketch of how to draw the face. Uh, I didn't do the live of this part, just in case today have something happen again. Okay, so uh, I, will, I will have, other than this is sample, I will have this guy here, this guy here, to show you next time how to put all those parts together. But today let's put each part separately, one by one. Uh, I bring this one from our art school. I didn't bring others, only the eyes. Okay, let's take a look of the eye structure here first. Let's say here. Usually we see eyes as of this part, right? The pupil here. Eye line, up and bottom. It's not simple as this. His eye is a little bit deep, so here is a little bit lower than the uh, bridge here. Not everyone, like, like our Asian people, it's not that deep, right? You don't have to draw like this deep. For, for this head, for these eyes, here is the upper eyelash down here, right? This is another line. For the young people, there's uh, no wrinkle too much. Don't draw too much lines. Um, be careful. And here's the eyebrow. Uh, let's see if we put on the paper for the sketch what it look like. Okay, I have some sample here. Let's take a look of here. Let's say here's our head size here. Okay, the head outline, just outline alone. Typically. Not for everyone, but typically it's like that. Measure the size of the height width. For example, here is one unit. Okay, use one eye width as unit to the side, another one in between. Same size of this side, same size from eyes to the edge here. So which means from the width of the head, one of the fifth, the width is with it for the eyes, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's again, that's for typical, not for everyone. And uh, if we start to draw the eyes, okay, one thing very common, most of the kids they will do, because uh, in our mind, it's the uh, eyes like this shape, right? This shape, and his eyeball. But in the real life, if you check with your family member, with your parents, no one's eyeball will fully show the ball shape in the between the eye lines. It won't happen unless it's very, really scary or really upset, open eyes widely. Normally, people only see like uh, most of them, not fully. And then down there, bottom, yes, bottom the curve you will see, but on top, it's covered by the eyelash here. Okay, let's start to draw a brand new one. Eyes shape is uh, basically is typical, although everyone has different eye shape, but it's kind of like a same olive shape, right? Same thing like that. Okay, some ones are round, some ones are long. Okay, you can put it up a little bit dark here because we have the thickness of the oil here, the skin here. Here's the thickness of this, right? So give a little bit of shading here, and then put an eyeball. So how big is the eyeball in eyes? Let's put one of third. One. Two, three, in the middle. If you look in the middle, okay? If you not look in the middle, of course not in the middle. Okay. That's it. Um, for the up eye line here, see, I don't have to connect the whole thing, the whole line, like a hard line like this. 
a leaf a little bit softly open in the middle. So even I erase more, let's say I erase more and more, I only leave this much. You still can feel the line here, right? You don't have to draw very, very, very dark unless that's put on makeup, okay? That's on purpose. Otherwise, uh, it's not like that. See, I erase most of them. People still can connect them all together. Okay, let's go back to eyeball. Things here have thickness. Eyeball have a very thin, small part of shade. Okay, uh, of the eyeball here. Here a little bit get down of the shade. Pupil. Okay, and then when you talk about the lights, depends where the lights come from. Look here. These lights is a reflect onto the side of the pupil. What if some lights are on the middle? It's here. Right? It works too. Okay. Here I go this way. Uh, I draw this part for the shadow. You don't have to, okay? The shadow might be uh, different from each different light setting. And down there, I give a little bit darker, a little bit here, darker. You see that? Now, now you can feel the transparency of the eyeball, right? Not a solid, remember, not solid. A little bit outline is a little bit darker here, right? The reason I use a 4B or darker one, I, I love to use the darker one like 6B. It's capable to go darker, right? Well, I always ask students to go darker, go darker. You know, when you hold the uh, hold the dark pencil, it's capable to do that. If you put some uh, H hard pencil, it's hard, right? And uh, here, gently here, a little bit shading onto the side, right? Um, here, suppose uh, with a little triangle, pink triangle between each eyes. You don't have to put it too obvious because uh, it's not that important. That's okay. Don't put everything you learned very clearly on the sketch. It's okay. Some part is into stand out, some part is into make it a softly reduced contract. Okay, here. Today, when you guys try the eyes, go check the people. The family member, but daddy, mom, or other people's eyes, or even look at the mirror, okay, of yourself. See, here is another thickness of here. Yeah, I, I know some girl would, would like to draw <laughs> down the eyelash. I don't like to do that because uh, I'm a guy, but I know girl would do that. That's okay. See, here, here, here has thickness too, right? But don't overwork it. It it's a little bit. Show a little bit is fine. Don't overwork it. Okay. Okay. I put on eyelash too then. Don't go too messy. Go to the same direction. Oops, I lost focus here. Come. Hey. Come. Okay. Okay, how about the eyebrow? I've done the eyebrow here. This side, eyebrow is above the right. So a little bit outside of the eyes, from here to go. And eyebrow is not as straight, boom, like this. Unless, again, unless you put a makeup on, but I don't think that's good makeup. It usually will turn from where? Turn from, see here? Turn from outside of the eyeball here. Go a little bit tilted. Right, got down. Eyebrow shape is all uh, different, depends what kind of uh, people are 
that's the part uh, what girls good at they can put a makeup on so they can change their <laughs> the, um, eyebrow or eyeliner or the different shape as they wish okay that's how to draw the eyes um, let's come back to see the front view and the side view I've done here front view I, we've just uh, finished right for the side view here is the forehead the bridge here and the nose we talk about nose in the next part okay and uh, the eyebrow it's not fully touched the side I give a little bit of gap if not sure, go check more people, more people surround you, take a photo, iPhone from the side, right? Check a family member, right? To see that. And the eye shape is, look, half of them. Oh, I put the very dark eyeliner here. Okay. Oh, again, I draw eyelash again. I don't know why. I can't control myself. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's a beautiful eyes. See here a little bit thickness, slightly. I see very gentle, very a little bit. Okay, pupil must be dark. Um, to draw the eyes become very transparency, just like we draw the glass. Give you a sample here. You have to put the dark shade beside the highlight. Okay. It's, it's like another highlight as uh, softly lighter hatching shading beside it there must be one side or more side go dark and then that become the bright highlighter no highlight sorry okay down there a little bit dark because uh, they have uh, reflection too okay see here for the bottom you don't have to fully draw a long line too here it's reflected right a little bit dark in the middle go soft and I go a little bit dark on the both side both end and uh, as I said you know here's a little triangle a little tip I don't know the name of that but don't overwork on those part okay just gentle uh, in today the first part I would you like to review again how to use our pencil see even here's a 6b if you control the well it still can go very softly very light okay that's the light part um, and let's stop here for now if anyone want to challenge for that I can send a photo to you but I will recommend you guys do the real people's eye uh, here oops lost my focus again okay here okay this part I will do the later because currently we just do separate for each different part eyes nose uh, mouth today okay let's uh, take a short break here right now bye now